Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's that time again, I'm about to take up another champion. And as usual, I'll give you a little bit of time to pause the video, leave a comment with your guess as to who you think I ranked up. But we are going to reveal it very, very shortly in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Emma Frost. So why did I choose Emma Frost? First of all, I love her. She is awesome, all right? And we'll have a little bit of gameplay uh, a little later in the video, all right? There's a level up going on right now, of course. I don't rank up, level up anyone without there being a level up on. And I just got her. And I was looking for a reason to use the mutant six star rank up gem that I had. And when I got her, I was so excited. You see that gem right there? I was like, oh yeah, who was I gonna use it on? When I pulled it, I had um, Magneto, Red Magneto, but I have Red Magneto as a five star already ranked five. And although he's worthy of being taken up, I didn't see myself taking him to rank three anytime soon. Emma Frost, I might end up taking her to rank three, not right away though. Uh, I still have my Omega Red. So I have Omega Red and Emma Frost now at rank two in the mutants of the mutants that I have. So uh, I will eventually take her to rank three. I don't know when, however, uh, but that's who I used my, you know, rank up gem on no regrets. Um, eventually I will have a tier five class catalyst and then I'm going to have to make a decision because Omega red, I don't really want to take him up unless he's awakened. She doesn't need to be awakened. So unless I can awaken Omega red, I may end up taking her up. We shall see. All right. So anyway, now we're in realm of legends. This is the team I'm going in with. Basically, I activated all of the synergies and we're gonna take a look at them right here. So you've got that one, 15% more attack in her diamond form, more damage, all right? Um, and you can see here each one uh, as we go. Uh, that switching to the diamond form does help. Uh, crits even while the opponent is blocking. That's like Corvus. And whenever she would gain one prowess, she gains two. That's more damage. All right, and I'm running suicides. Another reason that I like Emma Frost is she is suicide friendly. She will knock off the bleed, poison, no problem. And uh, just, and, and you're gonna see how tanky she is as well. So fighting against Winter Soldier is not the best showcase of her talent, but I want to see, I want you to see the damage she's doing. She's not even ramped up yet. You know, she's got some good prowess on her. All right. Um, that was her special one. It puts a little power sting. He, I got him to fire his special off. But look at those little crits. You know, not, not too uh, crazy there. But we're going to see some crits. Now, uh, notice that she switched out of her diamond form. You have to be careful about that. Um, one of the synergies does make it easier to manage. All right. Now, you see that special two? All right, it did some decent damage, but later on, you're gonna see a special two that does some crazy damage. And that's when she has her prowesses all built up. Now, I don't know how to fight with her the best. I just got her. I will be playing around with her more. I believe she will help me out uh, in Alliance Quest uh, for some of the paths that, you know, I have to take, all right? But here, I just wanted to show you the special one, then the special two, and now we're gonna see the special three. And after that, then we'll play around a little bit more and um, see if we can get a little bit more damage out of her. But look at where he's at already, okay? That's pretty good. That's pretty good, okay? Um, with all the utility she has, that is awesome. All right, so she's got some prowess. She's got five prowess right now, all right? And uh, 
Just look at the damage she's taking against that block. Not much at all. All right, here we go. Look at this. 22k crit, 60k crit. Nasty. Over 80,000 points of damage on her special two just now. It consumed the prowess charges, but she'll get them back. Okay? See, she's getting them back. She is a beast. Okay? I really do like her. Uh, and I was so happy when I pulled her. So, um, there we go. That's a 19k, another 18k. Didn't crit. Um, but still, that's some good damage. Okay? And you can see here, because she has one bar of power and she has more than him, she switched out of her diamond form. But because of the synergy, as long as uh, he has the same bar of power as she does, she'll be in diamond form, okay? Um, so that can be very useful if you have a case where you need her immunity and you need her to be immune most of the time. All right, so down went Winter Soldier, not too terrible. Um, good damage, but keep in mind that her utilities are what really attracted me to her, not her damage. I have big damage dealers, all right? So um, that's not the last fight because Winter Soldier didn't really showcase some of her utility. So before we end the video, uh, I wanted to show you guys a little bit more of what she could do. So we hopped on in here. Um, you can see I haven't done that path yet. I believe this is the event quest. Um, it, it might be the event quest or 7.1. I forget where I went. But Black Panther Civil War. Uh, you guys know the pain of accidentally parrying him when he has his armor ups. That stun will get reflected and you'll get wrecked. And he's quick with it. Okay. See the nodes here, biohazard. Um, I believe this is the uh, uh, the event quest. All right, so biohazard, I normally think of Omega Red and he's still a great option for that, right? But so is she. In her diamond form, it doesn't matter. She can hit into their block, hit into their, you know, hit them, doesn't matter, okay? Um, but what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna make sure he has those armor ups and then I'm gonna parry him, okay? I can parry him now because he doesn't have the armor ups, but here we go. There, look at that. You see the reflect stun? She's stun immune. So not only is she immune to things like bleed, poison, incinerate, and all that, but she's also immune to stun when she's in that diamond form. Beautiful. Okay, see, got some more. See, I have a bleed on me. So I fired off my special two so that I could get back into diamond form quickly because he didn't fire his special off. Got to be careful about that um, because uh, if I'm not in diamond form and I try to parry, I'll get wrecked. Okay, so here we go. We baited that out, took him out. Okay, so a little showcase of uh, what she could do, but we're not done. Uh, so I didn't want to try to find some fight to show uh, her telepath forms uh, utility. So I just went ahead and dueled uh, a Spider-Man. Okay, so the goal here is to get into her telepath form. Okay, so I want him to have more uh, power than I do. Okay, so you see here, um, I have a bar of power and I have more power than... Um, I'm sorry, I wanna have more power than he does. All right, so as long as I have uh, more bars of power, you can see he was not about to evade. No more evades for him. So she has some great utility and her damage is not bad either. So um, that's pretty much it. That's the reason that I believe Emma Frost is worthy of a rank two, even a rank three. I have her as a, a five star and I kept saying, I wanna rank her up, I wanna rank her up, but I don't wanna use all those resources on her. Um, and then I pulled the six star and that was it. Five star is gonna stay, I believe at rank three. Um, but her telepath form 
She can shut down invaders. I'm still learning her, so I don't know if there's something else about her telepath form that makes it desirable, uh, but I'll learn. Um, her diamond form, she can't be stunned, so she would be good in Alliance War, that stun reflect node. She's great for that. Um, she's great for fighting uh, encroaching stun. I actually brought her into uh, an encroaching stun path and she did quite well. Uh, so no regrets, no regrets at all. Really love this girl. Um, you don't see a whole lot of her being used, but she's good. She's really good. Uh, and unless I can awaken my Omega Red somehow, uh, I may just end up taking her up. I just might do that. Uh, I believe her prestige might be even higher than Omega Reds. I haven't looked yet, um, but I think it is. Anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. Do you like Emma Frost? Do you have Emma Frost? What do you think? Take care, and you all have a blessed day.